We have some breaking news. Novak Djokovic has split up with Goran Ivanishovic. I'm not which I'm not sure which way that is going, whether Goran has split up with Novak or Novak has split up with Goran, but it brings an end to an amazing relationship between the two. They have won 12 Grand Slams. Let's have a look what Djokovic has to say on his Instagram. Joker Norle on Instagram. I remember clearly the moment I invited Goran to be part of my team. It was back in 2018 and Marian Vida and I were looking to innovate and bring some nerve, sorry, some serve magic to our duo, of course, given issue, which one of the greatest ever servers. In fact, not only we brought serve, but also lots of laughter, fun, year and number one rankings, record breaking achievements, and 12 more Grand Slams and a few more finals to the count since then. Did I mention a bit of drama too? No FM would know. Of course, even though it has been very successful, it's also been very stressful for Djokovic and even Ishevic working together. Djokovic likes to vent his frustration and it's been Djokovic's job alongside other people, i.e. Charlie and his brother and his box, his managers, to take the brunt of that anger and to help Djokovic perform well. However, it's not easy. Gordon and I decided to stop working together a few days ago, so in preparation for the clay masters in Monte Carlo, the clay season. Our on-court chemistry has its ups and downs, or had its ups and downs, but our friendship was always rock solid. In fact, I am proud to say, not sure he is, that apart from winning tournaments together, we also had a side battle in Cheesy going on for many years, and that tournament never stops for us. Perhaps this game going on here, a board game of sorts. It's a great relationship between the two, and I'm sure they'll have a lasting relationship. Chefingo, maybe chef, chef. Thanks for everything, my friend. Love you. Of course, a great relationship. He's been there for half of Djokovic's Grand Slams, his second half of his Grand Slams to this date. And it's been a A++ relationship. It's worked for both parties. It's brought a lot of success, happiness, stress, but most of all, success. It is breaking news, but all things come to an end. And this chapter of Djokovic's career is over. Goran Ivanovic. He's no longer Djokovic's coach, and who's going to be his coach? Is he going to have a coach? Is he going to go coachless like Kyrgios? Is he going to rely on Marco Pancini, his fitness coach, hitting partners? Or will he look after, look for, rather, some experienced coaches like he did with Andre Agassi, even though that wasn't very successful? We'll see. He's the greatest player of all time, so whatever he chooses, we have to agree with as fans. So that's it. Let me know in the comments down below. What is your guys' opinion on this developing story or breaking news? And should Djokovic hire another coach? Until next time.